Hello, good morning. Wow, this feels so weird. I feel like I haven't done YouTube in the longest time. I am back. Probably didn't seem like I went anywhere, but it is the 4th of Jan. Um, everyone's like officially gone back to work, so I thought I'd vlog today. Um, it's actually my first day out as I got COVID over Christmas, typical, literally got it Christmas Eve. <laughs> I'm going out. I'm going to get my nails done. As you can see, my nails fell off. One of them did anyway. So I'm going to go get my nails done. Um, I'm actually going to go to Hobbycraft. I've never, I've been to one before, but not this one. Um, and I'm going to go buy a, um, like, um, what they call like a pin board because I'm going to put it above here and make a vision board. And I thought we could do that today together. And I'm going to go buy a printer as well. Wow, such adult things, right? And I thought we could sit and make a vision board. Here is my ugly, ugly outfit. You'd think if I hadn't left the house for like, I think it's been 12, 11 days since I left one out the house. you think I'd at least put on a better outfit, but clearly not. Um, I've got a lipstick on my teeth. Hoodie is H&M Men's. Coat is sheen from like a year or two, a year ago, I think. About a year ago I got this. Joggers are PLT. And they're my fake dunks, which we're gonna pretend they're real. Um, and yeah, God, I look awful. <laughs> I jumped this day. I've jumped this day for days and days. When I get to leave the house, I'm gonna wear a really nice outfit. I haven't worn makeup since Christmas Day, and it's the 4th of Jan. So at least my face feels a bit put together, but I'm gonna go out and I'll bring you guys with me. My New Year's resolution, well, one of them, is to actually do things with the vlog rather than saying, oh, I'm going here. Okay, I've just got back from here. Now I'm going here. Okay, I'm just back. Like, actually try and bring you guys with me. So we're going to try this together, okay? Hopefully this vlog is better than all the other ones I've ever uploaded. Cool, bye. What a banger. <laughs> oh, okay, right, I'm here. I'm here. I'm... I'm here. I'm here. I'm here. It feels so weird. I feel sick. Does anyone else feel sick when they put perfume on? I think that must be, surely it's a common thing, like your perfume makes you feel sick. Just a little bit strong, okay? It's a little bit strong, but oh, look at me. I'm here. I'm really excited to get my nails done. I think I'm just going to get um, plain ovals. I had ombre this time, but I think I'm just going to go for like plain, no pattern, cheap and cheerful. That's what I think I'm going to do. So yeah, I'm going to go get my nails done. I'm in such a good mood. I am happy. And I hope you're happy too. Yeah, I'm going to go get my nails done. I'm not going to vlog, am I? I'm not going to vlog. I just know it. I'm not going to blooming vlog. The thought was there. The camera is in my bag and the thought is there. Let me tell you that. Future Amber here. I thought we could do a little like get ready for dinner with us. So this section of the video is very, very kindly sponsored by HelloFresh, which I'm so excited about. I am gonna hold my hands up and say they are probably one of my favorite brands to work with ever. Not only is it good food, but it also makes our lives a little bit easier by having food delivered to our front door. We don't have to go food shopping. We've got three meals for the week. We literally have to finish work, come to the kitchen. We've got the recipe, we've got the menu. We've got the ingredients, we cook it and we're done. Like it is, it is actually that simple. For dinner tonight, we have had this one before. We actually use HelloFresh quite a lot. We just love it because like I say, it just makes things a lot quicker and easier. The recipe is also on the back just so you can see how quick and easy it is to Using do. Using the code AMBERNIGHT50, you're actually gonna save 50% off your first HelloFresh box and then 35% off the next three boxes after that. Well, it looks, I mean, I'm saying it looks so yummy. I already know it's yummy because we've had this one before, but delicious that was so yummy so much flavor and it was so quick to cook as well which is the best thing ever i'm gonna go hop in the shower now and literally just chill for the rest of the evening um which is fun but i will link everything down below again thank you to hello fresh sponsor this little segment of the video and i hope you guys really enjoy the rest of the vlog so i'm back <laughs> i'm so annoyed at myself because i didn't vlog I will try, I promise, I promise, it is my New Year's resolution. But, um, if I give you guys a little bit of a haul of what I did actually pick up, um, because I picked up a few, I didn't pick up loads, but just picked up a few little things I wanted slash needed. Um, I went to Hobbycraft, which was honestly so much fun. 
back at school I used to love art and like drawing and took art GCSE like absolutely loved my art can't say I'm very good at it but I just enjoy it so I want to get back into drawing <laughs> weird one I know but I just put myself up a sketchbook just to try and get me off my phone um and start a little hobby I guess so I picked myself up a sketchbook then went to Savers because we just needed obviously well we've not been out for so long we just needed like some little like toiletry essentials picked up some shower gel we seem to get through so much shower gel um some more mouthwash i also picked up the is it lenore i think it's lenore they're little um scent balls like you know the tiny little ball things i don't know they're meant to be good never tried them um but wanted to just give them a go so I picked them up also picked up these little pads if you're on the pill and you just get those like really annoying little periods these are so great for um just those like annoying little periods if you know you know um these are really good pads you can't get them in loads of places um they're saves i got these from they're just great I'm currently on my period now not that anyone wanted to know that but it's a thing that happens once every six months for me so when it happens i'm not happy about it uh oh <laughs> missing the main blooming thing Oh, it's so heavy. Okay, ready? One, two, three. The fact I carry this around the shopping centre as well. Pick myself a printer. Hey, hey! I just thought I want it to obviously do my um, vision board, which I think I might do tomorrow now. Um, but I wanted to do my vision board. But I also just think it's good to have a printer in your house. When Dan does his exams, he always has to print off um, these like. I don't know, it's like an ID form that he has to print off and take with him. And we always have to go to my grandparents to do that. So I just thought, you know what, it's just handy to have a printer in the house. So, picked up a printer and I think that was everything I got. Oh. And got this as well. My, um, what's, what's this even called? Cork board. I'm thinking, I did think here, but I think it looks a bit strange. I think I might do it this way and have it just here or not even that way have it this way have it just sit just here i think that might look quite cool so i think i'm going to do that <coughs> tomorrow because i actually need to order some paper i think ink comes with the printer but i need to order some paper because we don't have any like plain paper too high up there i have just got them ready because i'm heading out for lunch with a friend um which i'm really excited for when you've been stuck inside was what feels like forever honestly the thought of going out for lunch with a girl it's, it's exciting you know it's really exciting but i'll give you a quick ootd not that there's too much to talk about but jacket is i actually feel well, Dan found this. It was hiding in his wardrobe. This was from Misguided, like this time last year, I think I picked this up. Um, so yeah, they might still have it on the website. Jacket is misguided. Jeans, which you cannot see. A Princess Polly, they're just ripped knee. Um, little jumper top thing is also Princess Polly. Oh, and bag is Princess Polly too. Really repping the Princess Polly today. Um, yeah, that's my little outfit of the day, and I'm gonna go stick on my comedy gas ones. Um, yeah, I will see you when I'm out because I will vlog. I am, I'm gonna do it and I'm gonna vlog, okay. Come up for some lunch. I've got cala calamari, yeah, fries, these salt and vinegar onion rings are insane. Kirstie's got a rump steak sandwich. <laughs> Can be on my vlog for the first time. <laughs> Hi, 
It's actually the next day, but I'm just about to pop out quickly. Um, shopping by myself again. Today's OOTD. Really, really basic. I've just got on my essentials hoodie, which I haven't worn in so long. Kind of forgot I had. Um, so my knitted essentials hoodie. Body warmer, which is from... I think it's from Sheen. Yeah, body warmer at Sheen. And then I've just got some ribbed leggings on, which are from Bershka. They're actually really itchy and uncomfy. Bershka? Pulling Bear. But they're quite itchy and uncomfy. So I've got the thick thermal um, Primark leggings on underneath. And then I think I'm just going to go with my trusty shoes just here and work on these. Kill. Here I am again. Guys, I've literally barely even washed my hair this morning, but we, we move. <laughs> um... I want to come to Primark. I didn't have a video for Sunday and I don't want to miss an upload, so I thought I'd put out a trusty Primark haul. Why not? We all live in a Primark haul. Well, hopefully there's stuff in there, because if there's not, I obviously won't do a Primark haul. But yeah, and I'm going to go pick a Starbucks up for me and Dad. Because, you know, I haven't had them in a few days. Oh, that's so annoying. Um, but yeah, I'm going to go shopping and I will catch you guys even when I'm back in the car when I'm back home. So yeah. Goodbye. Hi, I'm home. I don't vlog in the kitchen, but as you can hear from here, the washing machine is on a mad one. But I literally went to Highmark, M&S, and Starbucks, and that was it. So I'll just give you an M&S food haul if anyone wants one. Well, it was only lit, and it was just like bits for lunch. Got some chicken breast for Timax we're having for heaters. Milk, pretty boring. And then for lunch, I'm going to have some, like, sticky white rice. These chilli and coriander ready-to-eat prawns from m &S. They're so good. Probably a little bit of soy sauce on my rice. And then toast a pita and put a bit of garlic oil on that. And that's what I'm having for lunch. And I'm so excited about it. So that is what I picked up from m &S. And that is... Everything I went to Primark, it was actually really good. I walked in and I was like, oh my god, this is going to be horrendous. Like, do you know when you walk in and the first lot of stuff you look at, it's just rubbish and you're like, oh, this isn't going to be good. But turns out it was good. So I'm going to take, go put this in the fridge, take all that upstairs. I will probably film now before lunch. Yeah, that's the plan. Doesn't look the most appetising, but I've just got sticky rice, soy sauce, pita bread, and garlic and coriander king prawns no maybe it's garlic coriander and chili prawns that is my lunch good morning it is now monday i didn't um vlog the weekend oh <laughs> um just because i don't know i don't know i don't know why i didn't vlog um but yeah i didn't get up to much especially on saturday i mean dan just went out for some drinks saturday evening which was really nice and then yesterday I went home and had christmas again with my family because um, my dad caught COVID just before Christmas and obviously me and Dan got it Christmas so we hadn't seen each other so it was really nice to see Ami, Arlo, my dad, my stepmom, my brother, his girlfriend, it was a really nice day. Um, so yeah and now we're here with today and I am so blooming excited. I'm going to do my vision board today, I'm in a really really good mood. Um, I just feel like there's a few videos I know I want to put out on my channel. I'm going to be honest, I haven't felt like that in ages. Like, I just haven't known what to upload. But I've got some fresh, new, little ideas. Um, bottom line is, you guys love vlogs. And I love doing vlogs. Like, they're the most chill, homey. Like, that's when you know me my most. Like, when I'm still doing a haul, don't get me wrong, I love doing hauls. But we're not sat having a chat, like, you, you, you don't get to know me if you watch me do a haul, um, you just know what I like to wear, basically, so I just, it's basically vlogs, but they won't be called vlogs, so, like, tomorrow I want to film, like, a 7am morning routine, um, next week I want to, like, on Sunday, I think I might film, like, a Sunday reset, and, like, get my life together and just, like, vlog that, so, like, just, like, more in-depth, in the day vlogs and then they'll still be weekly vlogs too we're vlogging all around um the vlogs are actually going to get a little bit more exciting rather than just me sat in this room it's dan's birthday next week so that'll be a next week's vlog he's going to be a 24 year old adult literally met him when he 
had not learned not long turn 20 and now he's gonna be 24 which is mad i mean i'm gonna be 23 in march which none of you can ever believe because i literally look 12 but you know what's fine it's fine my dad says it'll pay off when i'm older so i'm just i'm just gonna take that um and then i think the week after i might be going to manchester for a couple nights in the week uh with a friend of mine and she's so cool like she's so cool me like vlogging around her and um we've got all these fun ideas that we can do like we can like drive on the way there like like feel like a drive with me and then we can feel like you get ready with me like all in one vlog and just make like a really fun vlog so yeah there should be like a couple of exciting vlogs coming up hopefully anyway but yeah i'm just in like the best mood today like a really just happy mood i just got this like spark of energy last night um and like motivation so i'm in a good mood but we're gonna i'm gonna make this day quite long on the vlog so you guys can follow me around literally see everything i do today and go from there but the first thing i want to do i need to go brush my teeth and put my aligners back in because I don't want my teeth to move, if you didn't know, this isn't sponsored, but I am currently working with Smile Direct um, to try and move one of my, to try and move my tooth, because it was just a little bit wonky, so I'm very strict with making sure I've got my aligners in, so I'm going to go put those back in um, in a second, then I'm going to go sit at my desk, plan out some videos, I need to plan Dan's birthday, um... I want to get him, I think we're going to go away, but I don't know where, like the original plan was to go to Amsterdam, but obviously we can't go there, I think their borders are closed, you basically can't go to Amsterdam at the minute, so if you guys like have got any recommendations, this is literally going out this week, so I would really appreciate it, um, if you're still watching this high, um, if you could just like comment down below some like nice weekend away places, I wanted to go to Liverpool, but Dan is right, like we've been there a lot, and unless we're going to watch the football, which we're not because trying to get Liverpool tickets is just a joke um so that's kind of a write-off we're not going to do that we thought of Cardiff but there is they've got a few restrictions still so I need to look into that before booking anything so potentially Cardiff um but if you guys know any other places we're quite lucky we live in the Midlands so we're literally in the middle of the country pretty much so um yeah, if you guys have got any recommendations, we are going to London in a couple months, so it won't be London. Um, I'm going to Manchester the week after next, so not Manchester. I don't know where else to go. Yeah, if you could let me know where to go, I'd really appreciate that. Thank you. I've literally just plugged in my heated blanket. This is actually, I think, one of the best presents Dan has ever brought me. He got it me for Christmas. He knows me way too well. I'm always cold. So it's just a plug-in blanket and it heats up and it, oh, it's not like hot, but it makes a massive difference. Like I haven't had a hot water bottle since Christmas Eve. I used to have hot water bottle every single day. So this is, this is great. Um, and it doesn't overheat, it turns off when it overheats, which is really good, but I've just come to sit at my desk, I'm going to put my headphones on, I got these out, I haven't used these in actual years, um, and I found them in my drawer the other day, and I just, I love my AirPods, don't get me wrong, but I don't know what it is about these, it really gets me like in the zone, because it blocks out like all the background noise, it just gets me in the zone so I'm gonna put some music on write down some videos I'm gonna actually try and plan out the rest of this month just so there's like no missing uploads especially me being away like here and there I just want to be on the ball so I'm gonna plan out some videos now <laughs> I am really annoyed because I forgot to vlog my lunch, but I had bacon and pasta. Here is my coffee, look how good it looks. I didn't actually make this out of the coffee machine. It literally just 
coffee beans, uh, a little bit of water, and then I just put a jig of milk in the microwave. Froth it with a little electric frother, which you can, I think I got one on Amazon, you can get them at Ikea, you can actually get them anywhere. It's a little handheld little frother thing. And here it is, and then I just normally put some cinnamon on the top. Excuse, I've already um, organised cupboards. Um, but yeah, then just pop a little bit of cinnamon. Oh, oh that was way too, wow. <laughs> God's sake, run. <gasps> oh. I mean, it's like an A for Amber, so I'll take that one. Also, in case anyone cares, this is today's um, TD. This is actually Dan's hoodie. But I knew it would look really good with these leggings, which they go nicely together. So this is from ASOS. Uh, the leggings are Zara. That's it. That's literally my outfit of the day. I'm going back upstairs now. <clears throat> Okay, I'm currently trying to set up this printer, which I think we're there, I think I've done it. And then I can print my vision board, that's the plan anyway, um, and then I'll talk you guys through it. Not that there's much to talk through it, it's quite self-explanatory, but I um, forgot that this was an A4, so I don't know what to do, because obviously I don't... Just, I mean, maybe, but I feel like that just looks a little bit crappy. And the thing we don't want to look crappy is our vision board, clearly, obviously. Um, so do I, like, print some more stuff and just, like, pin some other things around it? Or I could, like, vision board 2022 or not in 2021? I feel like that looks a little bit childish, though. I don't know. I think I'm just going to print some other things and stick them around. And I also don't know if to stick it or pin it. I think I'll stick, I need some double sided tape. So maybe I'll pin it now and then buy some double sided tape um, and stick this down and then pin other things around. Cause this was only cheap and I did actually only buy this um, for the purpose of a vision board. Oh, that one is kind of cool. And will it go on the wall? No. Worst vision board you have ever seen. And, I don't think it's going to be going on my wall because it's going to go like this. Maybe I'll just get like an A4 frame and frame this instead. I wanted a pin board because I can just change it whenever, but I guess if it's in a frame, I can still kind of change it whenever. I mean, it's not awful, but it's just, it's just not how I wanted it to look. I'll quickly explain it. So these are all the holidays I want to go on this year. Travel is a big, big one. Um, we've got Ibiza, we've got uh, Barcelona, even a trip to London, uh, Venice is a potential. Here's the secret. This is actually my own picture um, because I want to finish reading it and the whole idea of the secret is obviously um, manifestation. It's a really, really positive book. So yeah, that's it screams two things. It's obviously like finish the book and also it's got the whole like manifestation around some things I want to do. I've put all my social medias on here, not necessarily for numbers. I've told myself this year that I've completely scrapped number goals and all oh, I want to get a hundred and fifty thousand subscribers and I want to get the fifty thousand followers on Instagram. Like I've just completely scrapped that. Like I haven't even got any number goals this year because I think that's what just puts pressure on myself. So I've kind of just put my socials on there with my current followers to just give me motivation, just go like I just want to smash it. I don't want to think about numbers. I just want to smash the content I put out there rather than the numbers that I get. So that's the kind of idea around that. We have a utility room. That's something I'm hoping, fingers crossed, we're going to get in the house this year is a utility room which will be attached to the kitchen. An office. This is like, this isn't what it's going to look like, by the way. This is just more the idea. So like 
uh, we're going to get a new office put in downstairs um, at the front of the house, which would be Dan's office. And this is also something that I'd like to do to the garden. This is actually a screenshot from my camera roll from about five months ago. Um, I just love this just here. I think it'd look gorgeous in our garden. I don't really know why this picture of myself, a bit vain, but it's more like to remind myself to just upload, try and upload some good Instagram content. A bit of fitness just there. I'm not mad on fitness and I don't think I ever will be, but I do enjoy the fitting after going to the gym. So try and keep fit and healthy in 2022. Friends, just here like going out with friends, having fun. I think that's everything. And then this is just more of like an aesthetic lifestyle, which isn't to everyone's cup of tea, but I would love to be one of those girls on an aesthetic lifestyle. I know that sounds really, really silly, but like, it's just silly little things like drinking two bottles of water a day, like that's something me and Dana, it's our goal at the minute to drink two. We have these um, one litre bottles, or are they two litre bottles? I don't know, whatever it is, we're trying to drink two of them a day. Um, being organised, being planned, good self care routine eating good, exercise, just things like that, um, and I think, I don't know, it's like somewhere in Italy that I'd like to go, so yeah, that is my vision board, really crappy, I think I'm just going to make this almost my desktop, or my laptop maybe, I don't think this is going to be going up, if it was just this one, like, I might just frame it, like, buy an A4 frame, and mm, I think we might have some actually, and I might just frame it instead and put it on the wall because I do think it's good to, obviously it's called a vision board, it's good to visualise and look at it, especially every day. Hello. Well, the lighting's normally good in here, but not today, clearly. Coming for a shower. Oh, wrong light. I'm just, I'm honestly, this is the most British thing I have to say, but I'm sick of being cold. Like, I feel like I've constantly just got a chill to my bones, which really isn't fun. So yeah, I'm gonna have a shower, put on my jammies. We've got fresh bedding. I mean, I still need to put it on, which I hate doing, but we've got a fresh bedding tonight, which is like my favorite thing ever. Um, and yeah, and then I think we're just gonna chill, have a cup of tea, have some snacks, and go from there. We had Hello Fresh for dinner. I vlogged it for the start of this vlog, kind of confusing. Um, so yeah, what you saw me have at the start of the vlog, I, I have tonight. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna hop in the shower, get nice and warm, debate whether to wash my hair or not. I don't think I'm going to. I can't be bothered to. I'm just gonna get in the shower, put on my pyjamas, and go and chill on the sofa for the rest of the night. Hello. I basically jumped on here to end this vlog, which I never seem to do actually on time and like in the evening. I normally do it like when I'm editing. Oh, it's Chopin. Let me standers, yeah. Oh, it's good. Oh my god, Pam! 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 She looks ancient. Yeah, she looks different, didn't she, compared to... What is this? This looks good. This looks good, whatever it is. Yeah, it's good. I love a good BBC drama, mate. Anyway. Oh my god. Tomorrow? Tomorrow we'll watch actually. that then. Anyway, came to end this vlog. Um, thank you so much for watching. I don't think you've even been in my vlog this week. Say hi. Hi. Say bye. bye. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'm going to end this vlog because it is 10. And I want to film a 7am morning routine tomorrow, so I actually want to get up at 7am, you know? Will it happen? Who knows? We'll see. We'll soon see. But yeah, anyway, thanks for watching. Goodbye.